In this video, I'm going to show you how you can limit the time you spend on social media. But I would like to ask you to please allow me just 30 seconds. Just hear me out. I don't do intros normally. But this is not an intro. This is more like a message that I feel it's very important for you to know. So on the screen, you can see the stats of my phone usage. This is Tuesday, October 27, 2020. My phone was unlocked for 12 hours and 30 minutes. Four of those hours were on FaceTime, two hours on TikTok, two hours on YouTube, whatever on my browser. I spend a lot of time on my phone and I'm pretty sure you're doing the same. This is not healthy guys, but I just want you guys to know the importance of protecting your own time. Because all of these social media apps, all of these technology companies, TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, they're all spending thousands and thousands of dollars hiring engineers and psychologists to make us use their apps more. You don't realize it, but on a daily basis, they're making little changes. Let me make the like button yellow. Let me make the like button red. Let me make the like button blue. Using which color do people use the like button more? Well, we made this change. Do people stay more on the app? Do people stay less on the app? And you can bet your behinds that these people are implementing the settings that make us stay longer in their apps. Because the more time they have our eyes, the more advertisements they can sell, the more money they can make. So our minds, our brains are being constantly targeted by these technology companies. They're working on our brains so that they can make us addicted to it. As a society, we are all addicted to social media. So I want you to use this app and see how much time you're spending on your phone. See what apps you're spending the most time on and limit that. I spent two hours and 13 minutes on TikTok that day. So I limit it to 30 minutes. And this is what I'm gonna show you today. So now let's jump into the actual tutorial. This app is called Digital Wellbeing. You can find it in the Play Store and most likely your phone already has it installed. And for my friends using iPhone, if I'm not mistaken, iOS has this feature as native in the phone itself. Like you can see how much time you're spending on certain apps. So whether you're using iOS or Android, I want you to go and check your app usage. So I'm gonna open it. So normally we'll go to the home page. This is my home page. It says how much time I've spent on my phone today. So if I click in the middle where it says five hour 58 minutes, it will take me to the dashboard, basically where it shows my app usage. So I've spent four hours and 23 minutes on FaceTime today. So if I wanted to limit this app, for example, I will click on the hourglass and then I will just choose the time that I will allow myself to use this app on a daily basis. So if I just want to use it for two hours, 30 minutes, I will just select the time and hit OK. And as you can see, since I've already passed that time, the app is like disabled. So I'm going to try to open this app. I'm going to click on Duo. And as you can see, your dual timer right now, it will start again tomorrow. So I just hit OK and I'm like, OK, I've run my time. Of course, if it is only something urgent, you can just go to settings and you can disable it there, right? But I want you to be strong and not because like, oh, I want another 30 minutes, I'm going to delete it. No. If it says that you'd run out your time that you set for yourself, just wait until the next day. So I have time on all the social medias that I'm spending a little more time than I would like to. So for example, Instagram, TikTok, and the other TikTok, the Chinese one. You will have a report of different weeks. I think it goes all the way back to a month. So this is this week. Today is Friday. So I have the Friday as Tuesday. And that's what I had at the beginning. I spent two hours and 13 minutes on TikTok. That's crazy. But the week before, I spent even more time. You see, on Saturday, I spent three hours and 25 minutes on TikTok. That's insane. When I saw that, I was like, okay, I definitely need to limit this. So this is very useful. I hope you find a use for it and you're able to detox a little from social media. Yesterday, I deleted my Twitter account. Tomorrow is going to be my Facebook account. Guys, we don't need that much social media. Listen, I will have a neutral mood or like a happy mood and I will go on Twitter and there will be something happening somewhere. Like it wouldn't have been even on my local news, but somehow it got to my Twitter. I will see it and I will get pissed about it. And now you're pissed. Literally because something happened thousands of kilometers away from your house and it doesn't even affect you directly. So social media, although it's great for discovering content and having your voice heard and connecting with friends, it's also like a all you can eat buffet of the worst fast food you could ever think of. Like an all you can eat McDonald's, basically. That's what social media is. You're just feeding your brain fat and chemical things that's just gonna kill your brain over time. You might feel good when you first see it, but over time, it will just 
damage your health. So I hope you find this video helpful and I hope you start implementing this today. Have a wonderful rest of the day my friends and stay safe out there.